say good morning neighbors <laughs> morning guys we just woke up we had a lion today and we woke up at 8 30. so we look we're nice and rested right jj and now we're going to brush our teeth and have some breakfast tidy up the house then have a bath and then maybe go out yeah yeah <laughs> chicken sausages yesterday that I'm gonna try out hopefully it's gonna be nice because me not know how it tastes like excuse me excuse me please you're blocking the fridge thank you you're blocking the fridge what is this oh every time we have breakfast JJ we should not have no mummy and son kissy time Get all the food all over my face. Um, what else do I need? Some eggs. Should I make a manual some? Let me think about it. Let's see whether he's gonna wake up in time to eat because I'll make it now, she's gonna get cold. And I've got other things to do. Unless he's gonna have to make it himself. Let's see. Stay there, don't come down yet, okay? Good boy. Babe. Are you awake? Hmm? Are you awake? What? Are you waking up? Why? I want to make breakfast. Mm hmm yeah, so you're going to be ready when it's ready? Mm-hmm. Ten minutes? In ten minutes? Yeah. Ah. What's happening? I'm making breakfast. Okay. What's with all the questions? I'm making breakfast. What are you doing? I'm vlogging. Oh. JJ's upstairs. Yeah, be down in 10 minutes, or be up in 10 minutes. So I'm actually excited about this Black Friday here. Basically, I am going to be jet setting next year. So I was looking at the prices to go to Australia and then to China and obviously back to the UK. And guess how much? 1,500. I think that is really good. I think that's a really good price. I'm just speaking to the Australians. When I mean by speaking to the Australians, I'm talking about my brother and my sister. I call them Australians now because <laughs> they've been there for like nearly two months. Oh, oh, Jesus. Okay. Stay there, stay there. Stay there. JJ just threw up and then I just cleaned him up now. Look what he's doing. What's wrong? What's the matter? Mm, you're not feeling well. Come. Come get some cuddles from mummy. Want some cuddles? No? Doesn't matter. No. Doesn't look like we're gonna go out today then. You wanna go to sleep? Hmm? I think he's tired. 
he threw up all his breakfast all over my body I had to like take off my onesie so we had to give, have him give him a bath in it how are you feeling hmm how are you feeling do you just like looking at yourself <laughs> Uh, yeah, so that's what happened. Had to get cleaned up. So breakfast is on hold for the adults for for a while. So get you cleaned up and dried off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I have finished cleaning this house. I am so tired. My man is still sleeping. I don't know what's wrong with him. I think because he went to bed like really late. That's why he's like sleeping and guess who's up? Who's up? Hello? Who's up? And having a snack? We're feeling all better now, aren't we? Hmm? We're feeling better. Oh, you, you wanna hug my leg? Hmm? You wanna hug my leg? So that's me done for this afternoon. It is almost 1.30. So I am going to just wipe the toilet and then I'm going to have my shower. Yeah, I'm gonna have my shower. And I'll show you guys my um, skincare routine that I usually do in the morning and I might do I might show you the one that I do for night time. I've just finished washing my hair. I got bored of the short hair so I thought I would take it off. And I just have my hair out. So I'm going to show you my skincare routine. So basically, you guys have mentioned so many times I use number 7. So this is the foaming cleanser. This is normal to oily. Because um, it's winter now, my face gets dry. So I decided to buy um, this hot cloth cleanser. So basically, I just put it on my face and put a hot like towel or hot um, cloth on my face and then for a few minutes, then wipe it off. Yeah, wipe it off and then just use my normal cream and stuff. Um, my deep cleanse also, I do that, usually I do that at night time but I only do it like every two weeks or once a month and I use the number seven exfoliator normal and oily as well and if I don't have my number seven face wash I usually use Garnier products as well so this one's just a daily um, exfoliator but this is for the blackheads and stuff so I'll use this usually use this one at night but if it's a daily one I use the free in one mask so the pure active free in one so it's got the wash you can use like the wash scrub or a mask I use that so yeah so I'm going to go ahead and wash my face because I haven't washed my face yet because I wanted to show you I've got to mention that I use um the Clarisonic Kamai 2 and this is really good. I would advise everyone have this. Like it's good for your face. Like it actually washes your face properly. I do like two cycles and like my face just my face is already soft, but it, it's even softer after using this. So yeah, this is really good. What I usually do is I'll wet my face and then just pump my soap on my face. Mm -hmm. And you can just wash with my mind too. This, by the way, is good for massaging under your eyes, like if you have bags when you wake up. And I usually, after getting my eyebrows done, I'll wash my face and just massage my eyebrows just to avoid getting those like um, spots under on um, those spots around my um, eyebrows. I'm going to like exfoliate my lips and I found um, well my brother and my sister actually recommended this and this is so good I can't remember what it's actually called like the actual long name 
but I'll find it and I'll put it in the description box below. Yeah, it's not on here, so this, I just scrub my lips because it's winter time. Our lips tend to get dry a lot, so this will be really good to do. I've just like dried my face. So one thing I would recommend is get a separate face towel for your face because if you're using the body towel for your face, you may get spots and stuff like that, so it's not good. So yeah, so I'm done. I'm gonna now go moisturize my body and my face. So I'm just gonna show you what I use for my face, like to moisturize my face. So first of all, I use the number seven serum. Apparently I'm not supposed to use this. This is for more older people, so I need to change this one. It's it's still the serum, but I will have a um, link to the one that I'm supposed to be using, and it's not this one. But usually I use a number seven serum, and then the early defense day cream, which is this one. So I use that for my face. And I usually use a dark circle corrector by number seven as well. So all I do is I just dab a little under my eyes and just sort of doing a massaging motion, so I've got an upward motion. And then what I do is just like massage under there and then around my eyes. Well, I naturally have dark circles, so I know that ugh, there's, it's not going to go light or it's not going to fade away. So I just use this just to prevent it from going even darker than it needs to be. So that's what I use. That's why I use it basically. So if you have dark circles, there's no point of you like trying to make it lighter. Then it doesn't go lighter. What happens? What tends to happen is that the rest of your face starts getting lighter, but hair just stays the same or it gets darker if you don't look after it. So that's under my eyes. I've started to use basically, I don't know if you can see it, but here it used to be dark. Like, really, I had like I got bitten, I think I got bitten or something, and I had like two, um, two or three spots here. So I started using this um, dark spot corrector. So basically, what I do is I just put it on the, the spots and then just like leave them, leave the cream on it. But obviously not making it visible that I've put cream on it. Yeah, but it's gone lighter than before. Like, it used to be so dark that you could see the actual, um, the spots. So this is really good. I would recommend this. This actually does work. So that's the number seven lift and illuminate dark spot corrector. That's that one. So I use this number seven eye roll on for under my eyes when I wake up and I know I've got like, really bad, um, bad bags and I'm just tired so this is really good as well just to basically give that wake up look when you um, have bags underneath your eye and just using the number seven day cream only doesn't make my face moisturized enough for me so I, what I do is I just tend to add like two or three drops of bio oil actually two is enough I say one or two drops of bio oil and then just to mix it and then just yeah just moisturize my face with it so this also is really good and it just like tones your face as well so that's why I use the bio oil so yeah so now I need to tackle this here so I'm just gonna like basically I just want to straighten it so I just finished straightening my hair I'm actually in love with my hair right, it's grown back so well yeah so I'm just gonna like Style it and see where I want my parting to be. So yeah, that's my hair for today. Thanks guys for watching this vlog today. I am going to have to end it here today because JJ is not feeling too well. So what I'm going to do is make sure you visit my blog site. I'm going to put a blog on my skincare routine for morning and evening. Because I was going to show you the evening routine but I've got stuff to do as a mum, you get me. So I'm going to do, a, I'm going to put a blog up on my site today. So when this video is out, you would have the blog on my site as well. So make sure you check out my blog site, blessingboyega.com. So you see my skincare routine for morning and in the evening. And um, 
what else is there to say nothing i guess so i guess i'll see you guys on thursday so don't forget to comment below like this video and subscribe also and have a great week ahead bye